saying goes, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. But what do you do when life gives you cancer? This is not a sob story, this is Stephen's story. And what a remarkable story it is. It began with a bucket list of things to do before he died of cancer, including raising £10,000 for charity. But his spirit has inspired thousands around the world, and his total now stands at more than £3 million, breaking all records on the Just Giving website. At his old school, friends have tied ribbons to celebrate his incredible success. He's always trying to get the best out of people. I mean, he's always said, just make the most of the time you've got. Um, he's always thinking of others. He's always just trying to make everything a bit happier, make everything a bit brighter. Last week, as he feared death was fast approaching, he posted what he thought was his final goodbye. A long list of celebrities tweeted their support. And when comedian Jason Manford announced a gig to help raise money, it sold out in just four minutes. Then last night, another astonishing breakthrough. A tumour that had caused Stephen's lung to collapse became dislodged, allowing him to breathe unaided for the first time in a week. It's a case of taking each day as it comes, he wrote, but at the moment, the days just keep on coming. He's a human phenomenon. His infectious enthusiasm for, for life, his, his positivity, um, he, um, he's just a very formidable and inspirational young man and, and, and really quite a role model. Stephen wanted to be a doctor so he could help others. He'll never achieve that goal, but the money he's raising for the Teenage Cancer Trust will help many, many others for years to come. Rebecca Barry, Five News.